Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive knees into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. level, from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Jung is two years his senior. The rest of the numbers are close. We send it inside the octagon. The veteran voice is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 17 wins, seven losses. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting in a Seoul, South Korea, the Korean Zombie Chan Song Jung. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, commit to the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. Are you ready? Are you ready? Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Look at a working at trying to shut the liver down. Notice the drive. Look at how they drive the knee right into the midsection. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Finish. Oh man, he's a hard. Oh, nice right hand. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Ooh, big shot lands. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. 
He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Chan Sung Jung presses forward and lands the Korean Zombie, going for it as usual here tonight, DC. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Back to the well with that right hand, it's no good. The Korean Zombie gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh, an educated jab there. I can watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. He's gotta be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Chan Sung Jung. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Just out of range with that right hand. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Lance with the right hand. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Nice shot to the body there. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. So three minutes have flown off the fight clock there. Look at the turtle in that kick. And he landed the right hand there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Nice defense there, huge block. Keep your hands up. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC, connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch right down the pipe. It's unreal. Lands with the knee of the body. Beautiful kick. Oh, nice. Under a minute to go in our opening round. Oh, that's a good strike there by Lee. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. <laughs> Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Ah. You are battering that nose. <laughs> Pretty good knee to the body by Lee. Oh, left hook to the head. It's blocked. Inside leg kick lands and immediately a mark on his opponent. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Nice punch, man. Fine, fine. So an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Big knee to the body. 
big body. Outstanding kick. output on both sides. Oh, perfect head kick there. Switching stances here. Big leg kick land. Just missed with the left there. The Korean zombie gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, and he lands a knee to the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. So full speed, put this body. It could in the night. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of the rare instances where everything comes together. Just misses there with the left. Lee gets caught with that punch. Ooh, head kick lands. Hurts. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Nice kick. Back and forth we go. Nice body. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Now he's got the Muay Thai club. And Jung's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Trying to kick the leg out. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Very nice leg kick there by the Korean Zombie. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. He's there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. A big punch lands through the middle. That was a thudded leg kick. Just missed with the leg kick. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick. What a kick by this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique. And before you know it, boom, he lands. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit, finish him off with the uppercut, that is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Oh, big punch land. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Rips the body there. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. 20 seconds to go round two. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Good job, guys. Let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect.
All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take effect. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. That strike blocked by Lee. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Well, the Korean Zombie's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Nice one, two there. There's no tell on that leg kick. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Plus right hand is true. Real quick leg kick. Lands flush with that right hand. Oh, a huge block there. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that's leading the dance. He loaded up with that right hand, too. Big kick land. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Lee's kick looked like it might have been a good one, but it gets it. Boy, Ty Plum. I mean, he's cutting down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. There. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Nice leg kick land. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, lands flush. He's gonna have to make some adjustments here moving forward. Watch knees to the body, big and kick. Really throwing with authority. That is, oh man, this dude is good. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Real nice body to land. Oh, big left hand there. And he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Look 
Look at the angle of that nice body kick. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Nice. Lands to the body there. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Big kick lands. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Liver kick. Nice strike. Well, his opponent found an opening there to the body. Nice hook shot there. But as he leans forward in trying to get into his own striking range, he's going to pay the price there to the body. Got to be careful. You don't want to eat too many of those power hooks downstairs. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Throwing that jab, no good. Well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Oh! Oh! oh over the top. This fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with the top level going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Looking to land the leg kick now. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much force. That shot blocked by Lee. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Nice knee to the midsection there. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Sneaky head kick. Nice punch by Chan Sung Jung. How about that chin? Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to counter after blocking shots. Big kick land. Just over two minutes now to go. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Well, don't get mad, get even, right? He got stunned by his opponent earlier in the round. He's clearly been losing since. Mentally, it appears as though he's checked out a little bit. A lot easier said than done. When his opponent has the power that he possesses, it's hard for him to say, you know what, I'm going to take one to give him. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head. Man. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy can play up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Jung gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Beautiful punch. You got to check these low leg kicks. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by the Korean Zombie. 
Telegraph that spinning back fist. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by the Korean Zombie. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Lee. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. 20 seconds left. Right hand, then a left. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Horn right. sounds for the end of round four. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. Oh! Oh! His head's still attached to his body. The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overeem versus Ngannou. And you know they still haven't found Alistair Overeem's head. Nice leg kick. Punch over the top. Some serious bruising going on in and around that right thigh. They want to check a leg kick or two. Huge knee lands to the clinch. Both guys appeared to land there. Big kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. Lands the right hand. Oh, that's a nice strike. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Visibly limping here. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Ooh, what a punch. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. It's such a fast leg kick. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. What a punch. Nice head kick. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Well placed kick there by the Korean Zombie. Counters with a left. Oh, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. It's coming high. And now he's got him hurt bad. That's a big strike right there. Two minutes and kick. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Knee to the body. He's going after the head. Big leg kick land. Jump gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, 
over and over, he's landing a big body kick. Lead hook is good by Lee. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Less than a minute now to go in the fight. Just out of range with that strike. Lee's got a bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. 45 seconds remain in the round. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike very effectively. Just misses with the streak. Oh! Leg kick land. Lee gets caught with that punch. All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. All right, the official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. The winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, he did not get the finish that he certainly prioritized when we sat down with him at our fighter meeting, but a win is a win. He gets it done by unanimous decision. And he said he wanted a finish, but sometimes...